I mean, I have like a, a kind of a serious question. Oh. So with AI becoming more and more in the forefront of programming, because I can see that it codes and it can code more and more in various different languages. It'll go into Python and this and that. So in the future, as people become more and more reliant on AI, will people lose the ability to program, you think? That may happen to some of them. I mean, game programming is very complicated. And so there, they can, uh, there's game programming systems where AI does most all the work already that is already existing. And uh, on the other hand, there's also many people that use AI to write small dinky programs that are just for a small dinky purpose, right? Let's say, I need to connect to a merry train, right? Or I need to do whatever. And then uh, AI does it somewhat, but not quite right. And then you need to kind of know where and how to fix it. Um, and so it does help to, to learn and how to do some programming. That's also why we do our software construction kit. It gives people the idea, lines of code is still valuable. And often, let's say you type up a bunch of lines and say, hey, computer, AI, why don't you write the rest for me? You get already an idea of what I'm trying to do. So it goes perfectly together. Also, what uh, AI is great at is helping people to understand programming concepts that they didn't know before. So it's actually a great learning opportunity because before it was very easy to get confused. The industry was dishing out new stuff so fast that you typically needed to study about one year to learn what the industry had introduced in the last year. Wow. So then you can use that, but no, you can't really use that because now in the next year they're already introducing the next year of what you need to learn. So every year you basically spend learning what the industry learned before, but now with AI you can get it explained much faster and you only need to get explained the stuff that you really need. So it's much, much better nowadays. Uh, people nowadays have kind of a golden age of learning programming because they can ask AI any sort of thing. Right? Say, wow, look at this crazy code that James Carmack put together to figure out the 3D uh, inverted root or something like that. And he had really crazy ass coding for that. And you can say, hey, can you explain to me how he did that? Ooh, oh. Wow.